next one was to announce lifetime achievement award for our senior members and immediately the name who came uh, which came in our mind is none other than dr rubin veerabhadra who is the uh, founder chairman of this uh, ima chennai kodambakkam previously now he was telling it was called as practicing doctors association where dr dashnamurthy and dr veerabhadra and everyone was there they were meeting every sunday evening in uh, kodambakkam in our uh, and uh, they have converted at the advice of ima Uh, headquarters to IMA Chennai Kodambakkam, and uh, it's not simply because he's uh, inaugurated and he's the founder chairman of the IMA Chennai Kodambakkam. We have invited him. They have chosen him. He's a very good physician who developed a family vision concept in Chennai Kodambakkam because that was my school of medicine in India, where I have um, learned every nuance of spring. I know how he treats his patient, how his patients are very obedient, obedient, and uh, they never say. Uh, what is to be done if chief writes everything is uh, well and good and uh, if chief says you have to stay for two more days then until the temperature brings down to normal they will keep shut they will not open their mouth that uh, came uh, because of uh, in 1994 when i worked uh, that was the, i was born in 1963 and that is the year when he started his practice so 30 years of practice and 30 years of rapport with the patients he had the full command to the patient and the doctors i remember still uh, in night duty when uh, he teaches me uh, he taught me a lot uh, nuances about uh, uh, medical day to day outpatient management uh, there uh, one patient he put every instruction like a child he has given like a new medical graduate he has put if heart rate goes what i have to do if heart rate comes down pulse rate everything he has entered given me and three days he has given two days he was doing night duty the third day came to me and uh, i was awake till 2 o'clock and at 2:15 the patient collapses and he died in the morning i was very guilty and uh, when he came into the clinic and i went uh, maybe sir if you would have been there maybe he would have been alive then he told it is not enough your fault and the way he consoled i never uh, forgot that's the uh, means uh, usually you put the blame on uh, other doctors what we see even if you get doctor they would like to say that If uh, he could have been more alert, he could have been this and that. He could have given this and that. So never he told that one. I still remember those things. And apart from that, he has uh, made two not made two sons of him are doctors. I would say if a father doctor and sons children become doctor, that means he has become the role model for their children. They know every hardships of a father doctor, but still if they want to become a doctor. Then it is uh, here that the both of them they have taken as a role model. So he has scored as a doctor father also, and uh, he is the one who has got at uh, that time when I was working, it was 80 bed hospital. Now it is 120 bed hospital. A single man to build in Chennai like a hospital like him is I think no one can. And the team of doctors, how he gave them free for a hand, and the way how he goes around in the hospital. the way he take care of the laborers in the hospital including myself i was uh, some 200 rupees left out when you paid the survey i went and told him <laughs> sir i i am a lack of 200 rupees definitely doctor we will pay it was a miscommunication you need to give me the 200 rupees the thing is you know he did not uh, tease it in, in the whole three years it was uh, uh, now uh, you know as a family patient i am scoring because of only because of the gurukulam where i stay and uh, having said all those things he is the only one to be given a, what if a lifetime achievement award the first person to be given is really definitely he deserves it it's all, it's all not we have chosen he is the only one to be deserved now this award will be followed but uh, the first award who who gets they only will give the award a, a meaning and i think uh, dr bn veerabhadran uh, honoring with this award is really going to be in a long run like uh, padmashri of ayame chennai kota mahakam please come in sir and i invite uh, dr uh, sundar raman to garland the sandalwood uh, garland please sir please come come forward sir
then yeah. somebody has to you know to develop leaders yeah. to follow you yeah and uh, he, he used to go attend uh, regularly this meeting and uh, health center uh, meeting also and i am in chennai for him give me a big thank Sir, one minute, sir, one minute, sir. Sir, you're going to go. Thank you, sir. On behalf of IMH and I, I'm going to honor you with this shawl. Sir, camera on. Sir. Sir, camera on. Personally, our uh, new Secretary of uh, Nursing Home and Private uh, Hospitals Board Chairman, Secretary, Dr. Sathya Narayanar, Mr. Professor Sathya Narayanar of SV Hospitals, personally wants to uh, honor uh, Dr. B. Mira Bhattran with Shaw. Thank you. I invite Dr. Dashanathi. Good evening. Sir, Dr. Dashanathi. Dear members, it is a great privilege honoring Dr. P. M. Birabhadra, whom I know him from 1986 as I landed in Kodambak, of course, Ramachandra Medical College. I know him as a very good physician. I was my mother was his patient. I know how the my son was born there. I have a lot of attachment. I used to see the discipline, the commitment, the commitment as a doctor. I think all youngsters should inculcate this. Anybody wants to inculcate this discipline. I am the only doctor I have seen who sleeps in the consultation chamber. Sleeps in the sense, in the daytime, he won't go anywhere. He can afford to go somewhere in there. He will be available. Take rest, start taking rest, wait until you get convinced, until unless it's an emergency. And uh, the way he has built up the hospital, its maintenance, I think we should all congratulate. And uh, being both sons, as he rightly pointed out, becoming, making them doctors and running the show is an excellent. And in his hospital, there is a board that is called as Trust. I do not know, so I remember, there is a board, a big board, that the patient doctor should have a trust. The trust only heals. See, if you see, most of the prior practice is like this. It is on personal basis. As the patient has a problem, he definitely thinks not the hospital doctor. I have to go and see this doctor. I have to go to that doctor. That type of trust, until unless you develop, you can't grow. That is the message I have learned from that. And with that, I was extremely happy and impressed. And I follow his guidelines in treating many, many orthopedic problems in my day-to-day -day practice. He is a very good human being, excellent doctor, and good specialist. Thank you very much, sir. There was a time when uh, doctors were called for uh, school uh, public functions and uh, so many uh, public functions. Nowadays, I think no one uh, uh, greets our, our own uh, senior man. So, it's our own duty to appreciate our own people. Only if we appreciate, people will be known to the public. So, it's the beginning and it's not the end. And now, the citation goes like this, Indian Medical Association, Chennai Kodambakam, Tamil Nadu. Lifetime Achievement Award. On this date, the 27th February 2011, this citation is awarded to Dr. B. M. Veerabhadran for outstanding contribution to society in the field of medicine. He was instrumental in melding South Madras Doctors Association into IMA Chennai Kodambakam. He was one of the pioneers in starting nursing, nurses training courses and also pioneer in establishing a private nursing home. He was one of the persons who brought about the concept of family physician. He was one among the few senior physicians who treats fellow members and juniors as his equal. He has been in continuous medical service for almost half a century. Yes, if uh, 2012, it should be 50 years. Yeah. Uh, we, president and members of the Indian Medical Association, Chennai Kodambakam branch, 
Feel proud to honor a Ryan in medical field. Sir, please present this one. Dr. Dashnamurthy is the past president and the pillar of IMH Chennai Goda Park. Sir, please present, sir. And give him a big weekend. Standing ovation is requested, please. Sir, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Give a standing ovation, sir. Yeah, sure. My dear friends and leaders, I am really humbled by the honor you showed on me. I thank you very much for this. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. <laughs>